In a harrowing incident during a curfew-enforced protest near Battery Tunnel, a young protester named Brianna was violently assaulted by the police. As the protesters marched, the police began driving through the crowd, leading to a tense standoff. Brianna, holding a sign that read white silence equals violence, stood her ground, insisting the police couldn't act violently. Suddenly, an officer identified as Inspector Gerard Dowling rushed at her, yanked her to the ground by her ponytail, and another officer pinned her down. I couldn't breathe, it was horrible, she recounted. Despite the New York Police Oversight Agency finding Dowling's actions constituted significant misconduct, Police Commissioner Edward Cabin buried the case before it could reach a disciplinary trial. A letter from the NYPD to the Oversight Agency claimed that the force utilized was reasonable and necessary. When Brianna found out her case was buried, Buried. She was angry, upset, and hurt. I, I don't even have words to describe. I was angry, I was upset, I was hurt. For it to just get wiped away, it's ridiculous. It's uh, very ironic how he's supposed to protect everyone. Meanwhile, everything just gets pushed under the rug. It feels like nothing's gonna wind up happening ever if someone like him is in charge. Dowling was promoted to the Internal Affairs Bureau, the unit responsible for investigating officer misconduct. He now serves as deputy chief of the unit handling protests throughout the city.